tell us on 0901 490 that's 0901 490 and good luck. Now, French and Saunders uh, were last on telly for their very funny Christmas special, and uh, since then they've moved into the big league. This is their first feature film. Here's the trailer. Comic Relief presents Harry Potter and the Secret Chamber Pot of Azerbaijan. Harry Potter is back. It's one year later, and he learns the truth. You're a woman, Harry. What is the Chamber Pot of Secrets? Harry Potter. What's the matter, Harry? I think everyone sort of knows that I wrote all the Harry Potters on the back of some baby wet wipes in a nappy changing facility in the Gorbals. Quiet, Hermione! Right. Hat, rabbit, rabbit, hat. So that's the rabbit. And the hat. That looks fantastic. <laughs> oh, that's as, that's as good as the real it's thing. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, oh, we, we did it. it in two days, three days. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but yeah, about that. How'd you get the props? It looks exactly like the film. Well, they, they got a lot of them from um, the Who real they? ones. They got some of the, the real stuff. Who played? Who was Dumbledore there? Uh, Nigel Planer. And I read that, that the, the wig and stuff was actually the one that, that Richard was, Harris wore that, for the yeah, film. Yeah, exactly right, yeah. But they did lend us a lot of stuff. It was great. We've got Jeremy Irons in there and Ronnie Corbett. Yes. No, not Ronnie Corbett. Oh, sorry, not Ronnie Corbett, obviously. That's a mystery. That's a mystery. It's a mystery. Um, <laughs> I'm only thinking it's a surprise because I read the Radio Times and they put a question mark over his face and I thought, oh. <gasps> it's a surprise. Oh, but could you okay. still see that it was Ronnie Corbett? No. <laughs> no, because it might not be him. It might not be. Pixelated Ronnie might Corbett. Not. Well, he has to live actually, if you think about it. Um... No, we'll have to see it. I you don't say much, though, I as don't, you're yes. run, aren't you? Yeah. Because yeah. when we were writing it, um, fell asleep. <laughs> 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 and uh, I originally I was going to do um, Hermione, and then uh, oh. we got Miranda Richardson, who was much better and prettier <laughs> and younger. And, um, <laughs> and I ended up being Ron. I mean, the, the joke we had for Ron was that he just, he just gurns the whole time. He does gurn. He sort of and he does. Man. I tell you, yeah. that boy works yeah. his socks off in the back of shop, doesn't he? <laughs> Don't he you steals think he, every he's scene. very funny. Don't you think he looks like a young, red-headed Frankie Howard? Oh, no, well, that hasn't occurred, occurred to me. That's another yeah. thing. Frankie Howard's a comic Frankie genius, Howard. Judy. I mean, it's a, it's a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but again, not very nice. <laughs> No, I mean all the uh, the gurning. The yeah, of, I see. yeah. When he was han very handsome, mm. when, when he, when he oh, was very oh, handsome, when he was time. younger, yeah. yeah. Then. Sorry, Rupert. <laughs> Much better looking. Frankie Who's Young. Rupert? Rupert Grint, who plays him. All oh, right. Come on. You oh, are well God. informed. Hey. Of course I am. I've seen them all and read all the books. They're great, actually, aren't yeah, they? Yeah. I mean, yeah. do your kids do your kids make you go and what? Do you, have you read all the books and all the rest of it? Because no. mine are no. Lenny has read them all to our daughter. He's read all of them. So I have earwigged. Oh, well, have you seen the films now? Yes. Yes. Oh, right. Oh, no, I was going to say, call yourself a good mother. Yeah, well, <laughs> you've read Harry Potter. No, She's never called herself <laughs> yeah. a good mother, ever, and she doesn't want you calling her that either. <laughs> I, would draw, I would draw the allegation. I'm a great mum. A terrible mother. Um, so, okay, so it took two days to film, which sounds amazing. Um, oh, no, about how, three or four. How did you get the suspended well, candles? Three, how did you get three. the suspended candles in the air like that? Computers. Well, it took, oh. I mean, I said it's, it took that long to film. I mean, a few days to film. But um, Aid directed it, Aid, my husband Aid, mm -hmm. and he, he did have to work a long time in the computer sort of place. Oh, right. Place. So that was all the, the real yeah. expertise was done, right? And how long does it last for? And we, we sit on Friday, it's about 20 minutes. Yeah, 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 it's in a couple of little bits on mm. Friday night. Mm. Right. There's yeah. all really sorts of treats on Friday night, actually. It's a real labour of love for you lot, isn't it? I mean, yeah. you and Lenny and you and Adrian and Richard Curtis yes. and all of you. I mean, you've been... 1986? Yeah, isn't absolutely. It? But you know the brilliant thing yeah. about it is that, you know, uh, with Jonathan and all the people that, that started it at the beginning are still there, but we've also got Ant and Deck and yeah. we've got all the new, Cat Dealey and all the new people yeah. coming so on as well. So there is a young generation, hopefully, coming to take over. <laughs> to all the old Ricky Gervais <laughs> is involved with it, you know, so it's, it's, uh, it's fantastic. We did a sketch for it once, didn't we? And they cut it. Oh, yeah. no! Yeah. No. Oh, it that very good. Was crap, actually. That's what was it? <laughs> <laughs> it, didn't, it didn't work now, tell me something, Dawn. Are you going to reveal your bra at all tonight? No, no, it's safely tucked so away. So you're actually tucked away, <laughs> are you? Yeah. Yeah. Every time I see you at the moment, 
you get them that's out. That's true, actually, isn't it? That's, that's you do like really your comedy excuse. boobs, don't you? I do. What are your comedy boobs for pride? Hmm? Well, I did get boobs at age about five and a half, so I think <laughs> I, I had to put them to good use. <laughs> hers aren't comedy, hers are real. Jennifer's were comedy. No, I do find Dawn's comedy. Thank you, Judy. <laughs> that's, that's a lot. <laughs> no, I meant, the, I meant <laughs> those things as well all the time. I mean, the what, no, no, the ones you wore. You know, the ones oh, you strap on. But they were the best prop we ever found. We found <laughs> early on in our career, we found, you know, if you can't think of a joke, get a prop. <laughs> and um, we found comedy asses. Yeah. Oh, comedy tits, and they, yeah, yeah they're top. just the you best. You never put them back And I tell you, just have a pair at home. <laughs> it's a great party trick. They cut You know, them. if the dinner party gets boring, you just open. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they cut, you, they cut the bottom <laughs> out of... Um, out of your spoof on tipping the velvet there, didn't they, at Christmas? Your the Christmas special? No, they kept one bottom in, didn't they? Oh, there was one it? bottom bit, yes, there was. Well, they, that was a strap-on bottom, wasn't it? Yeah, strap -on yeah but, they, but the BBC there. cut it out, no. didn't they? Oh, did they? Yeah. I wish they'd cut this bit out. I thought I saw a couple of arses in there. <laughs> oh, that was us. Oh, that was you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, you got that before me. Um, you didn't cut this bit out, and this was um, this, this got a lot of hate mail addressed to oh, us. OK. Hi, Judy. Richard. It's the Richard and Judy show. <laughs> She's Richard. I'm Richard. It's Richard and Judy show! <laughs> <laughs> right, good, great. Welcome back. Good afternoon. Good morning, good afternoon. I no, it's it afternoon. Wrong. I got it wrong. Afternoon, <laughs> evening, early evening. <laughs> right, so. Uh, what have we got on the menu today, please, right, Richard? What's happening? Uh, Who's coming on? on? We've got some uh, great kids from Emmerdale that we've not heard yeah, of. We, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we've got, we've got some, some old people. We're yeah. going to give them some Viagra and see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Dangerously close. <laughs> Did you script that a bit? Because that, that looked so ad-libbed. Unfortunately, it was scripted. It was scripted, yeah. <laughs> do you That's script, do you script the crossover goes. when you're talking over each other? Is that all part of the script? No, we do that naturally. Ah. Yeah. Well, now, listen, I've got a bone to pick with you about that. They cut. <laughs> I've got a bone to pick with you on that because oh, yeah. you know that, you know we, know we threw we, we threw puddings in your face at the end, yeah. Yeah, but yeah. you right. knew about it. Though, and you know the script. Yes, we were, yes, yes. I know. We were specifically asked to bring along a coat, oh, right? Geez. And I oh, just oh the dry cleaning bill's coming. I it is. Just got. <laughs> Has anyone got forty quid? I on just. Them? I read about it. <laughs> this is the correspondence. I Judy just got this <laughs> new coat. It's the first new coat I've had in fifteen oh. years. This is Cactus Television versus been. the BBC. <laughs> we're on the relief. Just watch the clip. It went all over me. Honestly, come. This is for me and for Susan Hampshire. Yeah. And this, my lovely, is for me. And all the other people that you've ridiculed on this travesty of a show. Are you ready? <laughs> Come, Judith. 